have arrived at your destination. Hey, Ale. How can I help? Jump in the buggy. I'll tell you the story on the way. Ramiro was looking through old things at his padre's home last week, and he found this photo. He gave it to me, said I might enjoy it, but I don't think he realized what he was. My friend, what would you say are the two most important things in Mexican culture? Uh, family and... Family and art. Family and... <laughs> Close. Familia and the Volkswagen Beetle. Bocho is the Mexican nickname. My bisabuelo Fernando was the first Torres to own one. And thanks to that photo, I think I know where it is. Seriously? Let's go find it. Tell me about him. His abuelo means great-grandfather, but in the family, he's just Papa Fernando. We never met, but everyone says I'm exactly like him. <laughs> Loca por autos. You have to understand, in Mexico, a bocho is like the family member that lives in your garage. Papa Fernando loved that car to death. <laughs> this is definitely the place, but... No sé, why would Papa Fernando bring the bocho up here? The storms can get tremendas. Just get the door. Is that key? <laughs> it's really here. <laughs> we found it for you, Papa Fernando. But look at it. I've never seen a beetle like that. The weather's closing in. I don't like the look of the roads around here. You drive the truck. Got it. I'll have to put in a new batteria, plenty of oil, llantas, electrico. Oh, this is gonna be hard, even for me. It's a beetle. I bet it starts first go. <laughs> you know, I wouldn't be surprised. Find a way past it? I think I can manage that. <laughs> That's one way through. What are you gonna do with it? I have muchas ideas. That's the thing about a bocho. It's not just a car, it's a lifestyle.
park the truck here. I'll take care of the rest. What did I tell you? Finding cars isn't magic. It takes good luck and hard work and sometimes a drone. <laughs> Ooh, my friend, the hard work is just getting started. Call you soon. <laughs>